According to the Preventive Test Code for Electric Power Equipment, in the preventive test, an inspection test should be carried out on the arrestor base and the discharge counter. A discharge counter is generally connected in parallel on the base. During operation, when the lightning current passes through the arrestor, the discharge counter will act. It can record whether the arrestor operates and the number of operations, so as to accumulate data and analyze the overvoltage situation of the power system and the operation of the lightning arrestor. The main problems found in the operation of discharge counter are poor sealing and moisture, and even the internal components are rusted in serious cases. Therefore, when conducting the preventive test of the lightning arrestor, it is necessary to check whether there is moisture or water droplets inside the discharge counter, whether the components are rusted, and whether the installation of the sealing rubber gasket is glued, etc. If any defects are found, they shall be dealt with or replaced. To check whether the discharge counter operates normally, the impulse current generator is usually used to add an impulse current with an amplitude greater than 100 ampere to the counter to see whether it works. Take HTFCHI arrestor discharge counter calibrator as an example to introduce the action test of arrestor counter. Connection mode is as follows. Instrument connection. The top terminal should be grounded. Connect the red terminal to the red wire and the black terminal to the black wire. Connection mode of arrestor counter. The red wire is connected to the top of the counter. The black wire is connected to the G terminal, which is the housing of the arrestor counter. After connection, check the connection is correct. Test process. Press the power button to turn on, when the voltage reaches the voltage required by the discharge counter. Press the impulse test button. Then the discharge counter should display 1. Go down in sequence, wait until the voltage rises to the voltage required by the counter. Then press the impulse test button. And the discharge counter will jumps again. When the test is over, turn off the power switch. Note. 1. The red and black terminals cannot be reversed. 2. During the test, it is forbidden to touch the shell of the arrestor counter and its live parts. 3. During the test, the number of discharge indication digits before and after the discharge counter test shall be recorded. In principle, the number of digits indicated by the discharge counter should be recovered to the pre-test position through multiple action tests. <laughs>